You return home and you just know something's not right. Why does my window look weird? You're positive you locked the front door when you left. Oh no, where did all my CDs go? You've had a break in. Someone who was uninvited has violated your private space. Residential and vehicle burglaries are the number one crime in the city of Hollywood. Observe and report. See something, say something. You know, be alert. That is it. That is it. If something doesn't feel right, give us a call. Burglary Detective Sergeant Pablo Venegas has spent years on patrol watching for suspicious activity. His trained eye always on the lookout for out of the ordinary just doesn't seem quite right activity. It's not a person's appearance that makes them initially suspicious. It's their actions, it's their behavior, what are they doing? It's the little things that might just stand out is uh, why is that vehicle in the middle of the road? Uh, or uh, maybe that vehicle is parked to the side but the door is open and nobody's around it. Those are, little, those are the signs that just pop out. It's like, makes us look twice at that situation. As residents, you are familiar with the day-to-day -day routine of your neighborhood. When out and about, take a moment to look around. You'll know when you see something out of the ordinary. If you have an alleyway in your residence or where you, where you live, you're going to be out there, you know, throwing out the garbage or if you have a pet walking the dog. Okay, you know, be a little more vigilant. You know, take that extra, you know, two seconds and look around for your neighbors because hopefully they're doing that for you. If you see a vehicle that just stands out or a gut feeling, it doesn't hurt anything. Just give us a call because we more than likely we're going to be in the area and we can, uh, we can make sure that that vehicle belongs, you know, it belongs in that area. Be a little more vigilant on both days because that means there are going to be people going around. Just be a little bit more uh, conscious of what, who's out there. And if you have a plain panel work truck that's backed up to somebody's garage uh, with the door, you know, open or it's been there all day or it's, or it's sitting in the alley, I mean, it's, it, those are things that you should just question to yourself. If someone is going around and trying door handles, that's a classic car hopping. All they have to do is open it and, uh, and grab whatever's in there. If a bike is propped up against a fence, uh, that could have been someone who traveled into a neighborhood with bad intentions and now he has his bike put up because that's his way of, of escaping. Something like that would definitely get our attention and it should get yours too. To partner with police, here's what you should do if you see something suspicious. Try to get a description as quickly as possible. A simple method is start from the bottom up. You know, there are situations where the criminal is running and might change his clothes. It's less likely for him to, sh to change his foot attire. So always work your way from the bottom up if possible. If you got that gut feeling, get a description of the vehicle, keep it with you, jot it down. The description is very important because we got to be looking for, you know, what you saw. But it's also the location. Where was the last time you saw them? What were they doing? In which direction were they walking? We don't want you confronting anybody and we don't want you to get, you know, be scared of everything that happens in your neighborhood. Just be a little bit more aware. Sergeant Venegas notes the prime time for most residential burglaries occurs between 8 a.m. and 2 p.m. when people are away at work. Nighttime is the prime time for personal vehicles to be broken into. That's when residents are home and their vehicles are parked in dark driveways and parking lots. We don't get too many smashed windows in, in neighborhoods. Does it happen? Yes, but most of the time they're just going around trying door handles uh, to see if it's unlocked. Please, you know, anything valuable, take out of your car. Do not leave that eye. We get so many reports of cameras and weapons and iPods and laptops because they left them in the car, in the open, unlocked. You have to look out for each other. You know, everyone goes on vacation. You know, everyone goes out of town. And, uh, and you want to be able to feel comfortable that even if you have an alarm system, the best, you know, preventive is, is extra eyes on your, on your property for each other, looking out for each other. To take a more active role in preventing crime in your neighborhood, consider joining Crime Watch and becoming an active volunteer with the Crime Watch Mobile Patrol. Contact the Hollywood Police Department Crime Prevention Unit at 954-967-4314. Getting involved in your neighborhood or civic association will also help you stay on top of events impacting your neighborhood. Go to hollywoodfl.org and click on the How Do I menu you to find your neighborhood association or contact the Office of Public Affairs at 954-921-3201.